Windows does come with a built-in antivirus, but it's not exactly the best one that you'll find. My name is Edullah, you're watching Canada Technology, and in this video, we're talking about the top 5 best free security software that you can download on your Windows PC. So uh, here I have a list of all the five programs and we're going to start with Process Explorer. Process Explorer is a part of the Windows uh, Sys internal suite by uh, Microsoft. Uh, it's not entirely Windows, but it does include a host of uh, tools that can give you uh, way more detailed information on your Windows system than what you get with the native ones. So uh, as you can see here, we have a ton of different processes. Uh, we can find uh, processes more easily, kill them, kill process tree, restart, suspend processes. So this is all uh, standard uh, task manager stuff, but uh, with a little bit more power, of course. So for example, if you see uh, powertoys.exe right here, uh, if I hover on it, I can see the command line uh, command for every uh, power toys module that's running and uh, with just one button so you head over to options go to virusrotal.com and check virusrotal.com and you can just run a scan for every process on your system on virusrotal which means you can completely get a top-down view of how secure your system is just with a few clicks moving on uh, we have uh, what is auto runs so autoruns is also a yet another program from the sys internal suite and what this does is that it shows you every single app that starts up on your pc automatically once you boot your system in here uh, you can see that i have a full list of programs that start with my pc so discord ea app notion plux uh, hpsu launch controller uh, internet download manager ghub microsoft edge process that auto launches despite me forcing edge to not launch and every other program that i have so uh, and you can also see the registry key where they are registered and of course if you've bought a new laptop or a new pc you know that it comes with a lot of bloatware so using this program is a really quick and easy way of uh, finding any programs that might be running on boot and slowing your system down now if you find something that uh, you don't want to run you just find it uncheck it and restart your system to check again once again with just one click of this button uh, you can uh, show virus total entries so uh, if i click on this i should be able to see the virus total entries right here so it's a really easy way of getting a bird's down view of everything that runs on your system and of course making sure that they're all protected. The next program is uh, PE Studio. Uh, PE Studio is essentially a file analyzing program that uh, reads executable files and you don't need to be a tech genius in order to be able to use it. All you have to do is just grab a file and drag and drop it here. So uh, let's see. You can try and provide it images as well. As you can see, it immediately read the whole thing and it will give you the SHA handshakes, the first 32 bits of bytes of the file in hex, then in text, and then it will find out indicators footprint. Uh, it will run virus total on it and then the strings inside for example after running this image let's try running this uh, syspro installer.exe which is the install file for uh, komodo firewall so let me just relaunch pe studio and then i will drag and drop this executable file in here so as you can see it immediately scanned the whole file ran a virus total check and uh, this file is good to go there are no known detections in here at the moment and of course an overall uh, breakdown of the file as well so it's a really good handy tool in order to quickly assess any executables or any other files that you believe are malicious uh, so we just want to check them before you run them and of course, the link to download this uh, along with the rest of the programs will be in the description below. Moving on, uh, we have HXD. Uh, so HXD is basically a hex file editor or reader per se. Every file on your PC has a hex code. So for example, if I follow the old process again and I 
drag and drop the sys pro installer executable in here you can see that uh, it shows me the hex code of the entire file and this is a really 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 big file so when is this useful because this clearly is not data that you can read and it's not meant to be human readable well a lot of the times uh, malware developers use empty space in their files to inflate the file size so if it, a file let's say a 200 kb malware has been expanded to 500 mb you will see that a majority of that file will just have these zero hex lines uh, and it won't be populated like this one is and if a file is actually populated all the way top to bottom uh, as you can see in this uh, so this entire file is pretty much completely covered with data which means it's not been artificially uh, inflated and we've already ran it through virus total thanks to auto runs so hxd is also a tool that you can use to quickly analyze executable files read the inside data and figure out what's going on last but not least we have the komodo internet security uh, tool this just used to be a firewall in the past but now it's in it's a fully blown internet security suite so you get an antivirus you get a firewall and the firewall in this thing is what i'm really interested in and talking about today so you head over to the protection section click on the firewall and then click on view connections and then you get a birds down view of every process that's using the internet on your pc and of course since this is a network security suite or basically internet security suite you get your uh, firewall controls like blocking applications managing networks you can also stop all network activity with just one click and then of course uh, you can quick scan your pc for uh, any viruses or any malware as well and the firewall user interface is also slightly easier to understand than it is compared to your regular windows firewall if you want a very lightweight tool for firewall protection tiny wall is also a good alternative for komodo so as you can see it found one thread which is basically just the hp omen light studio which controls the rgb on my laptop i know that's all good so we can go ahead and close it but uh, especially for looking at firewall connections this is a really good program and that's that these five inner security programs you should absolutely have on your system if you're looking to get into cyber security if you like this video consider subscribing give us a thumbs up press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below what most such videos can we do for you and if this didn't help you out and you require an extra bit of help consider getting our membership follow us on social media follow me on instagram or twitter visit our website candidate technology for more tech info and we'll see you in the next video